If you are new here, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel and my YouTube family. Um, I took a shower earlier, so my hair is already dry. And right now, I'm going to make food. I'm going to make some enchiladas. I hate this little small little hair. It just comes out. But, um, yeah, I'm going to make uh, some enchiladas michacanas my style, how I make them. Because obviously I'm not from Michoacan, but I ever since I tried Micho uh, enchiladas Michoacanas, I've never went back to eating it like how we used to eat them. I'm saying like how my mom makes them. The enchiladas Michoacanas are way, way better. All these dishes came up through. But um, yeah. So, um, today I got a, uh, a, um, message of Gordo's teacher that he's going to have a sneak peek, um, on, kind of say in two weeks he starts school, so I'm excited, but I'm sad at the same time, but, um, yeah, but, um, I'm going to do the food. Um, what I was thinking, cause me quedo poquito de, cause I made um birria uh, yesterday, so I still have some meat. So I'm gonna make some um, enchiladas with that carne, cause normally I just make it of cheese. So I'm gonna do with that. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys how I make it, and then hopefully you guys enjoy it. <laughs> Look, there you go. There you go. So um, how I make them? Check it, baby. So how I make them, I get some guajillo chili pods, I put some of that, um, I don't have any negro one, uh, negro um, chiles, um, but I'm just gonna do it with the ones I have and then some California ones. So, in my little pot, I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna use a few. I don't like count how many I use, I just, I'm making chiladas. You know me? Si, sí, también para ti. No. Como que no? I want it, it's my daddy. That's for your dad, oh, todos para tu papi. I want to. So these are how much I use of the California ones, and I'm gonna get some of the um, what you wait, Kayla. No, 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 don't do that. I just take off the little stem. And like I said, just add how many you decide on. I only used the five of the um, guajillo ones, so and that's how I'm going to do it. I always like to put it like in a bag, the chiles, and save them. I'm sweating like there's no tomorrow. Stir and cook it until it boils. That's going to be the salsa part. I don't have to make... um. Enchiladas, I like to make like a kind of spicy, semi-spicy um, salsa to put on top of it. So I already made that yesterday because I made, um, like I said, the birria tacos. So that's, that is ready. I don't have to make some of that. So the salsa's here. Um, my favorite chocolate. <laughs> um, I have to cut some onion. Here's the crema I'm going to use, the crema mexicana, and then cebolla, put the lettuce, I need to cut some lettuce to put on top, and then the potatoes and the carrots. So, wash them, obviously. 
you're gonna peel them this is how i make them everyone makes them their own way and obviously i'm not from michoacan so i don't make it exactly how they make it but um, enjoy them we all enjoy them so all right baby kayla's over here trying to help me they can't see you <laughs> cooking time yeah. okay so i'll get back to you guys right now oh, there's like water but um once they're peeled and I chop them up, so like that, I'm gonna boil that too. The um, veggies and then picar todo, picar la cebolla, just a little bit because Kyle likes inside his um, his uh, enchiladas. And then I'm not gonna cortar it, baby. And then um, some lettuce for the topping on top too. And then I'll show you at the way, way end how I prepare them and everything. Give me them, baby. Give me it, give me it, give me it. But yeah. See you guys. I'll get back to you guys right now. Literally uh, peeling them. Look. Gotta teach them young. Yeah. Are that KK? Yeah, I'm stronger. You're stronger, baby? Look, she's peeling them. I see the young grab, baby. Woohoo, KK. Good job, baby. Help mommy? Yeah. Oh. So she's literally. I'm trying to show you guys at the same time. The there you go. You, you, baby. You give it to me right now so I can cut it. Put it right here in the sink. Yeah, good job, Kike. Let you do your crown. What? Is it done? Yeah. Okay. okay. So she washed it and she peeled it. Yeah. I did good. Okay, go to the other one. Other one. I'm here watching her, so so I'm cutting the um, carrots like this. Uh -huh. Kayla, she's eating and cooking at the same time. And I tell you, yeah, where you watching where you? Yeah, come on, come on, come on, Kayla. Right, I'm gonna put away the dishes because there's a lot of clean dishes. So. Go around there. Go around there. No, I already cut it. No, 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 I'll cut it. But yeah, I'll get back to you guys right now when this is all done. So I did do the two um, potatoes and I cut it like that. And then the carrots, I only added one more, so it's three carrots. Cut them like that too. So these, I'm gonna cook them with some salt. Um, and then right now, I'm gonna cut the onion that I said I was going to cut. I'm only going to cut a little bit because the guy is the only one that likes the onion inside of his um, his enchiladas. I don't really like, I don't really mind. So I just cut literally probably a little piece and it's so hot here in California today. Like I can't. So that's how much I cut. I probably just cut a little bit more because I feel like it's a little bit. Yeah, like I normally cook earlier, but today I was busy helping Kaide getting him some stuff that he needs for his work. So I was like up and down since like, what was it, like 1030? So I got out of the shower and he's like, oh, I need you to come and bring me this. And I'm like, oh, great. And then from there it was from another thing and then another thing. So. I was super busy all morning, so now, right now it's 3.20, so I'm halfway done cooking, so it's, that's what I like, that it doesn't take forever to make this. It te rinde mucho, like, if you have like, a lot of people coming over, you don't need too much, you know, to spend. So that's the onion I'm gonna cut. Get a little tupper I'm gonna use, rinse it. I don't know, I always like to rinse everything, even after washing it. It's una maña. <laughs> so it's not a lot of onion. It's just a little bit. Cut it up. Don't come at me on my cutting. So <laughs> everybody cuts different. So yeah. So this I'm saving it right here. The onion. I'm going to put the rest of it away. Because I don't need it anymore. 
I don't know. I like to clean as I go. Do you guys clean as you go or, or you don't do that? I don't know. I like to clean as I go because I hate seeing a big old mess. So right now I'm going to clean when I'm done with this um, so I can um, uh, put the dishes away because I have a lot of dishes that I wash in the morning before I left. So um, I just have to wash them. I mean, I have to put them away because they're dry already. And the lettuce, I'm not cutting too much because, well, that's me and Kai because the kids, they do not like the lettuce. So, uh, Kayla is not that picky, but, um, and it's already washed, so I'm just going to use it this much and just cut it. I went to Dollar Tree with the kids. Um, I didn't give you guys a haul because it was just a little things I got. I got a little um, nightlight for the kids. Well, each one got one. Um, they both got an ice cream. I got a chocolate ice cream. I love the M&M sandwiches that they sell there. If you haven't tried it, try it out. It's really, really good. And um, I got some corn nuts. I love these corn nuts. I'm going to snack on them right now when I'm doing cooking. So, um... That's the lettuce I cut. I'm gonna get another tupper so I can put that. I can put the onion on the side. Not in the same thing, but on the side, you know, put it all together. I need to desmenuzar el queso. So shred the cheese. Um, I'm gonna use a queso fresco. You can use literally the one that you want, but that's the one I use. Show you. Okay, one second, baby. Um, let me show you guys real quick. So that's the cheese. Um, I should I um, love this menuce. And then this is the cheese I got. You can use literally any kind of cheese. But um, the next thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to wait for the chiles to be ready. There, I think they're almost done. Just let them cook good. And while that's cooking, I'm going to put this away. So I'll get back to you guys right now when I'm going to blend the chile. Hey, guys. So um, I just finished washing the dishes. I mean, I put away the clean ones. Um, have you guys tried this simple, this simply uh, watermelon juice? drink I really like it it's like very natural you can taste the watermelon pretty good um on to um what I'm doing next so I put this together the cheese and the lettuce I'm gonna put this to the side So what I'm gonna do now? Where's my tweet? Where's my um? I'll say tweezers, but my pizza. Okay, there's the cheetah. The cheetah from here. I don't know. A lot of people use this water. I don't really use this water. I'd rather use like regular water. You just need to eyeball it when you're cooking. That's all I know. I can't really ask like say measurements, but I just put a little bit of water. Let's see. I'm probably gonna go to three cups. Probably. Yeah, three cups. And then I'm going to put some uh, garlic powder. Eyeball it. Like I said, just eyeball everything. Um, what else? I need some... I don't really use a lot of like condimentos. Some of this. Putting like that much. 
and you can just try it i don't like to do it too like uh salty because i'm the sauce and then you would add the cheese and the cheese is very salty so you would put it together and then with the crema and the, everything so it would get a little like salty so that's what i learned to not do too much of the sal you know so I blend this i'll get back to you guys right now i just blended it Okay, but wait, let me finish using it because that's what I'm using right now, baby. So, let me just... so in the same um, pot, you do the chiles. You're just going to let it heat up a little bit. So turn on the... You have to cook the veggies right now, but... Just let it like heat up a little bit here. Okay. Let that heat up a little bit. And this is the meat that quedó de la birria that I made. And I learned by myself. We're just watching videos and I would just add this and add that and I learned doing it. I learned it. I learned doing it by myself watching videos. So nobody taught me to do it. So I make birria, so that's some of the, the meat that I'm going to use to put inside. Um, I'm going to wash these other dishes, and then I'll get back to you guys for one second. So, I, on here I put some salt, and then I put the carrots and the potatoes. Just let them cook for like 10-15 minutes, because we are going to guisarlos um, after with some um, oil. I'll show you guys that too. Here's the salsa, the one I made, and then here is uh, the meat. So I drained uh, the veggies, and I put some oil here. So I'm gonna put it here just for it to get like a little toasty, but not you know like burnt or anything like that. So um, I'll show you guys right now when I put them in. So just put some oil, like I said, and just like. Fry them a little bit, and that's it. And then this is ready. So this is the topping you're, you're gonna put um, on top of your enchiladas. So this is how I did them, just a little doraditas. When I start prepping them in a little bit, um, I'll vlog for you guys. So it's already six, and I'm gonna have dinner right now. Um, I'll show you guys how I prepared the enchiladas. Yes. There you go. So, you're gonna turn on your stove. And then, I'm gonna use this pot, pan, pot, pan, this thing. <laughs> um, got some oil. Olive oil. Yeah. Okay. I'll take out the tortillas. The cheese I already have out. So you're going to let it heat up. I'm going to show you guys right now my setup. And me. So the only thing I don't like about making these enchiladas is it's very like messy to cook this. But it's very good. So the I put some oil. The salsa there. The chile. The tortillas I'm going to use is Guerrero. You can use any kind. And, yeah. So here's the setup. Let that heat up. I'm going to make myself three. I don't make more than three because with all the toppings, um, I'll fill you up very, very easy. And it's so smart. And I don't know if the kids are going to want to eat because they already... Eight, um, oh. vas a querer comer? ¿Qué? ¿Quieres comer? Pizza. No, quieres comer. A pizza on the taco pizza. So what you gonna do? Pizza is, taco, yeah. You guys always want pizza and tacos, so get tortilla and put it here. You're gonna repeat the process. Kayla. My booty going to fall. So get one of these. Oh. 
flip it over right away flip it over right away now and this is where you're gonna put the keys in I like to put mine with my windows like cheese. I love cheese on mine. So that's how much I put. Like I said, I hate that it's very messy, but um oh well. But yeah, just let it simmer. Then there's the first one. There's the second one. Like I said, and I like mine like bien doradita, so. Are you guys gonna want to eat? No. Enchiladas. Quieres enchiladas? No. I want pizza tacos. Tomorrow we're gonna go to the pizza. There you go. And then what you're gonna do, like I said, flip it. The tea is kind of ripped, but it's fine. It's fine. Like a music, Kayla. It's fine. I have to tapar this. Chile, so this guy just went home, so. I was going to wait for him, but he hasn't gone home, so. Yes! One second, let me finish doing this. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. no. Tú quieres pizza todos los días. Pizza tacos. Pizza tacos. It all depends how you like them. I like mine, like I said, doradita, so just look them. And I always have a plate with like a napkin so the oil, the oil can, you know, get rid of oil. Make that much greasy food. So, let me get back to you guys right now. So here's my plate. Like I said, I put them here so they put them escurrir del aceite. Del aceite. It's got all that extra oil that you don't need. In your body so you put them like this and then from here one second I'm heating up these you put how much um, papas you want on top oh one flew off okay so you put the potatoes on top like I said and then now you're gonna put the lettuce, how much lettuce you like, the cheese, how much cheese you like. I love cheese on mine. And then now crema, if you like crema, if you don't, then you don't put some. I'll leave it like this because guys it's almost gonna come and then the salsa it's not spicy so that's how much I'm gonna put so that's how my plate looks and I'm gonna do a taste test right now with you guys so I got this at the gas station it's a uh, minute made um they made I guess uh agua frescas and it's in a mango I'm gonna try this see if it's good and this is my plate. What is this? What is this? Enchiladas. Try it. Carrot. What is this? Carrot. Ay, Kayla. So, yes, I mean, so, awala. Boca. I love these. Like, if you try, if you guys try these out, like, let me know. Mom, I'm not hungry. Get it? So Kayla's right here now because now that she does want one, so I gave her one of mine. 
I'm probably gonna get four with two anyway. Mommy, so. mommy, mommy. Yes, baby. Hard to cut. And I had to. Mommy, mommy, mommy. 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 Mommy,